president tonight oh. says the ag program is important enough for her to consider attending another school that offers FFA. Because FFA means a lot to me. Um, and I would try to help the other Hey, that I got a new clutch. It's a browning handle. No kidding. It's a fucking browning gun handle. It's fucking nice as hell. I just put it on yesterday. Huh? Yeah. I just thought it was cool as hell. Can you hear me okay? Can you hear me okay? Can you hear me okay? Hang out a little bit. Alright. I got you on speaker. Okay, because I got you on speakerphone because I just left the meeting. No, I got you on speaker. I got you on speakerphone because I'm eating. Ah, well, it's not my fault. You're fat. Come on now. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> No, nah, meeting went good tonight. You got a lot of praise from a lot of people. They're all on board with you. They, they. I missed the first half of the meeting, so they, after the meeting, they informed me about the uh, you and Bob going at it online. And um, I got to find out more that Bob is really going. They, they know for fact now that Bob is going out of his way to cost us our sponsors. Well, and what are you gonna do about that? Well, Glenn, Glenn and them have they, they don't know they're they're they don't know what to do because before when they 
you know, it wasn't something really that was known. When it wasn't something that was known, then they thought they that it would just go away or they would just, you know, kind of be done with it. But now that they know for a fact it's Bob and that he's going out of his way to do it, they don't really know what to do. In fact, Glenn flat out said they were going to give him a plaque and an award, you know. This was something they were actually going to do anyway for his other for his years of doing it. They're not even going to do that now. That's how much they do not like him right now. Every single person basically said we ain't doing shit for him if he keeps running his mouth. <coughs> I get him some pressure five pressure five horseshoe. Well, the thing about it is he's gonna use the excuse why he's not see, I guess he used to fish with some colonel or something. That colonel can't be there this year because he's gotta be at Fort Bragg. But he's gonna use that to get out of the tournament and you know, he, he's trying to be sneaky about all this shit, but he's not, it, it's done loss. He's not being sneaky about it no more. And he's, he's actually pissing people off now, and he's done pissed off the entire board. In, in other words, our entire board basically voted to basically not do shit for him because he's costing us sponsors, or he's trying to go out of his way to cost us sponsors. And yes, he's did a little bit for Fishing for Freedom, but there are other people that have done a lot more for it and everybody, everybody asked, when did this become about Bob and not about the vets? Oh, yeah, he's he's he put $5,000 the Well, and see, that just said he didn't do all that. In fact, and then he's sitting there trying to spread rumors and gossip about money situation. And none of that's true, but he's trying to cost us our sponsors by saying that stuff. And it's all lies. He's actually lying the cost us to basically get sponsors to pull out. And, yeah, and he's over here coming five stealing money. Yeah, five boaters from Northside are not going to participate this year because Bob convinced them of a bunch of bullshit and because we dropped we didn't drop it on purpose, it's just we, we're not using uh, Northside this year for the fish fry. No, I told him it was a good So, you know, I don't know this guy. And the thing about it is, they're very open. They're very open where all the money's going. In other words, I know where all the money's going. I know who's got what and everything else. And, you know, it, it's kind of like this is the most open meeting that I know of. To where we know everything going on. And I guarantee you, nobody is screwing anybody.